Hey everybody, what's going on y'all? Had to turn the radio down. I don't want no, no strikes or whatever. But I want to ask a question. Am I the only one <laughs> who goes to the gym and when I get on a machine, I just want to take a nap? <laughs> I swear, I don't even want to work out. I just want to take a nap, y'all. I get on them ab machines, you know, the ones you lay on your back, and then you go back and forth. I just want to take a nap. I get tired watching other people working out, y'all. So I don't, I did my little uh, half a workout. <laughs> my little half a workout and got up out of there, y'all. I got up out of there. I got to do better. But baby steps, y'all, for anybody who is trying to lose weight, you didn't put the weight on. It took time to put the weight on. So it's going to take time for you to get the weight off. I have about a couple years of truck driving weight on me. I'm not saying it's going to take a couple years for me to get lose the weight but that's what's ha what has accumulated around my body <laughs> so i don't get too wrapped up in um one instant results or i know i feel a little better you know i know um i can see that i'm losing a little weight you know i don't get on scales i don't get on the scale because i don't like want to you know measure my weight loss using a scale because if i don't see any movement within this in the scale then i'm gonna start getting discouraged so i just don't even use the scale um it's going to take a while but starting is half the battle as long as you start, look at the chin, y'all. I ain't never had a double chin. <laughs> chin so nice, I had to have it twice. I ain't never had a double chin. So, it's all good. All oh, this about to slim down. I'm gonna see my cheekbones again. You know, it just take a little work and effort, y'all. In the meantime, in between time, uh, I'm going to stay focused. So anyway, that's what I wanted to get on here and ask. If anyone ever goes to the gym and get on one of the machines and just want to take a nap. That's all I want to know, y'all. So anywho, I will be getting on here later and I will be doing a video on uh, Kanye, Kim Kardashian. And it will be called the curious case of kim kardashian's coochie okay must watch must watch anywho let me get off this thing i got things to do i gotta do a little laundry and whatever whatever so anywho while i got the camera on i'm gonna go brush my hair like the mirror like i got a mirror <laughs> I want to go to Bed Bath & Body Works and get me some shower gels and body sprays. But I know that Valentine's Day, I might need to wait till Valentine's Day because they're going to have a good sale on Valentine's Day. And I'm all about the sale, so I'm going to hold out. Wait till Valentine's Day, get my smell goods. Even though I'm single, still got to get your smell good on, honey. But I really think <laughs> that I'm going to meet a cowboy. I really think, like, look, let me how you tell you how to manage, even though this cowboy was full of you know what. But I keep, I, for the whole month, I've been saying that I'm going to meet me a cowboy. So I get online. This is how fast some manifestations work. So I get on, go, on, go online and guess what's up there? A black guy with a cowboy hat, <laughs> cowboy boots. And I say, Oh, are you a cowboy? He said, Yeah, and I've had and I have horses. 
So he's an official cowboy. He don't just wear the hat and the boots. He got horses. <laughs> he ain't out here flexing the flies like he a cowboy. He got horses, okay? So yeah, y'all. Let me get up off this thing, thing, thing. Anywho, yeah, that's all I wanted to say. So stay tuned to my upcoming video about Kim Kardashian, Kardashian and Kanye's relationship. I will go through a few things. I'm not going way, way back. But um, yeah, I'm going to talk about some things. And I'll make you laugh too. So stay tuned. TTYL, y'all.